Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. I'm super excited about today's video. We're doing the September Mystery Roundup review. I'm so excited. This month was chock full of just amazing mysteries, so I cannot wait to go over them all with you. This is of course a collaboration with Jen of Jen Joy Plans as per usual, and I'm taking a page out of Jen's book and I am trying to film this a different way, which I feel like is going to look so much better because I love the way she does it and I find figured out how to make it work in my setup so super excited about this video you should definitely check out jen's video which i will link down below jen is amazing you guys already know that though so let's just hop into it the first kit obviously is caress press and i'm pumped i really like this kit i love the teal i feel like the teal is just popping it's so beautiful when it's mixed with this kind of like minty green color i just feel like this is beautiful and i love the like travel theme it's called wanderlust but it looks like italian vacation to me i love that this is out of office that's so cute we have all the like italian food they did some shopping this beautiful like cityscape the passport the super like old-fashioned looking luggage the vest but i just I think it's so so cute i want to go on this vacation i'm not <laughs> planning this vacation anytime soon but this is beautiful and i just love the vibes um let's just move on to the next picture so you can see like the full look of it and you see the colors all together obviously the kind of like light beigey tan is not my favorite color but i understand how it works in the spread and i feel like it does all come together really nicely do i wish that this chocolate brown was the color instead of the beige yes but you know we can't have everything so i really like this kit it's definitely super cute if you are doing any traveling you're going to europe obviously or you're doing any sort of like wanderlust or maybe you just love to travel or like that's something you've always thought about this would be a good um kit for like a birthday for somebody who loves to travel as well but generally i just really like this i think it's so stinking cute like come on on the scooter that's so cute with the hat i just love it i love this it's so so cute and this girl's like drinking her drink super super cute and the teal is popping i've been really into teal lately so i love this and then you have the kind of like teal e looking um foil as well so 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 cute this is a great great kit from cross press great mystery all right glam planner this one is the one i was really most excited to talk to you guys about because as you guys may have noticed for the past like couple of months glam planner has not been giving me what i want in terms of a mystery but this is stunning like this is stunning i almost like screamed when i saw this because i was not expecting this and i love it i think it's so beautiful so cozy so like fall this lake vibe like wow so cute this dog i don't even usually like pets and kids but i think this dog is so sweet and like just the vibes it looks like so cozy i i don't know another word to pick besides cozy but i just want to like go to this lake house it, it is called lake house and just like cuddle up with my book and my like hot chocolate and just oh so good so beautiful it's such a special kit um and this is perfect for a mystery i just obviously it's perfect for fall um or you could even do it for like a like a special occasion maybe like a romantic getaway that sort of a thing could be kind of cute it's just beautiful or maybe just like a week where you're trying to like relax kind of like reset recenter it just looks so peaceful out here on this water like stunning stunning I love the colors like look how bold all these colors are guys i'm obsessed like i think this is so cute and this is exactly what i want so i really like this it's so really pretty i love the colors the green with the dark blue and the patterns like this is just such a stunner of a kit beautiful i cannot wait to see people use this also this nail set i literally I've just been talking about how I want to get brown nails. We're going to go to Chicago shortly and it's going to be, you know, fall in the city. And for someone who lives in LA where it's, you know, still 90 degrees outside, it'll be so nice to be like cozy and fall. And so I want to get brown nails. And so when I saw this, I was like, oh, so, so cute. The sweater, the turtleneck and the earrings, the glasses and like the dark vampy lip, like it's 
it's fall i'm so wow like this is such a cute kit like i i want to live this life it's so so cute it's so cute i love it and this like the accents in the home just beautiful i this is a stunner this like terracotta color is also like a personal favorite color of mine recently i got a sweatshirt that's this color um and i just i love like seeing it it's just so pretty and it goes really well with like kind of like the blushes and like the the warm browns i just i'm a fan like don't you want to cozy up on this couch please this is such a beautiful kit i whoa whoa and then the gold hollow with the leave deco like i probably wouldn't use all this if i got the kit but the leaves stunning but honestly i don't know because it is such like a natural looking kit i don't know if i would want to put the like sparkles on top of it but the leaves are stunning and i think gold hollow is a really good choice for this kit so honestly 10 out of 10 for land planner with this one this is beautiful okay pink diamond planner go <laughs> i wasn't ready for this either so like i said we're going to chicago um in october and this is not scream chicago in october because it screams that to me when i saw this i screamed because i was like this is perfect super cozy super fall and like city fall which is what i'm about to be doing so you better believe i'm using this kit next week i'm so excited about this it's chef's kiss i love this like so so cute i love all the leaves in this one and this dress is so cute a little pumpkin and all the baked goods and the cinnamon roll this outfit i like one of these pants i love that color though oh wait next here you go so now you can see the colors you guys know i've been loving like like the caramel brown colors like this is my color scheme right now i love everything in these colors so this is perfect i am so excited about this kit i cannot wait to use it i'm gonna use it with the gold foil i love it maybe should i do gold hollow with this now that i'm looking at it or maybe copper mm. i was really thinking gold but i don't know also obviously tasha went off and darcy went off as usual with the add-ons they are ridiculous like you get for completely brand new fashion people stop beautiful 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 and the scene is so cute then the extra colors like this taupe which like isn't my favorite color but don't worry because i love all these colors anyway so i don't even need it that's the one thing i really do like about tasha's kit is like if you don't like something don't worry you have 75 other options so you can pick something else like it's so easy to customize to your personal preferences i wish i had this outfit so like i could wear this in Chicago, but I definitely do not. More along the lines of the Glam Planner Girl with the um, turtleneck. Wait, let's go back. The turtleneck, I think I could find a turtleneck like that. I have it, my turtleneck is more of like the brown, like the deep brown, the nails, but you know, I could go for that. <laughs> and then here is the extra tall box, super stunning. I love that this person is a tall box because I think this dress is really beautiful and it's nice to see that. Then you have obviously more of the more like taupey color for the additional color. Oh, here we go. Scribble Prints Co. This one was cute and cool and very unexpected. So it's a Westworld theme, but it could also be like very much just like Western theme. And at first I was like, Western theme, I don't need that. But then like, honestly for me, I definitely would have used it if I got it because it would have been a really good October kit for me. You guys know I don't really do like spooky scary, but the colors do read like kind of warm tone, which reads fall to me. And it's kind of like dress up or like pop culture or like fantasy, which I feel like goes for October, even if you're not doing like the spooky elements of Halloween. Does that make sense? I feel like that's what I tend to lean towards during October. And so I do have sometimes like more difficulty finding a kit that's not so like Halloween gory. And this would have been perfect. So this is super cute. And it makes me kind of want to start watching world again but honestly i really forgot what happened i like stopped watching maybe maybe i finished season one but then i like waited a long time to finish to start season two and i was super confused but fun fact i actually met tandy newton who plays this character in real life like i was working this internship and she came in and i guess i forgot that she was british but then she was talking to me with a british accent i was so shook because a it's tandy newton and b like she had a British accent, I wasn't expecting it, but she was so lovely and so sweet. And so every time I see this kid, I always think about that interaction. She was so, 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 so sweet. So maybe I should watch it again. 
But anyways, here are some more of the full boxes. So pretty. Like, it is, like, very much, like, Western theme. If you have, like, a Western theme, I don't know, dance, something, you could definitely use this. Or any sort of, like, dress up, like, I know people do, like, masquerade things or, like, dress up parties for our Halloween. You could use this even if you aren't going as, like, Westworld characters or Western characters. Or if you go and travel anywhere that's like, feels Western. Like, if I was going to Texas, which I actually have always wanted to visit Texas and I've never been. So, this would be a good kit for that. Or if you, like, live in Texas or, like, somewhere that feels... I don't know why Texas feels, like, the most Western of Western states, but I feel like that would be fun. Um, or if you like have like uh, little kids in your life who like like trains like the western like you know dress up I think that'd be really really cute so I really like this kit it's very different and I haven't honestly been the biggest fan of some of the pop culture kits but this one I actually really do like and I love the coloring like I just love these rich warm like terracottas oranges and browns like I'm really into that right now so it's a it's a cute kit for me I do like this teal it's like kind of new to add on to it with the doodles this is like such an extended format as well you do get more of like the muted colors here but I feel like the art is like really like the rich browns and oranges so I really like it I think it also would be good for like a road trip I was I, I thought this one like came out it's like um we did a road trip well we did a road trip for a wedding so it's not really like i couldn't use this kit but if we had just done like a regular road trip this might be cute too because i could see like maybe if you live in like nevada or something where that it looks more like this that would be cute but just like kind of like open space where you're not seeing a lot of like buildings or people like that would be a cool kit or reason to use this because it also kind of gives the same feel as that like road trip art from scroll prince co so I kind of like it. I'm kind of a fan. I love this orange. I would definitely bring in this color because I think it's so, so cute. And I would definitely, just to kind of break up some of this, like more of like the nude or like the taupe color. And it comes with like this copper foil, which is the move, I think. One thing I think that Andrea has been doing recently is like maybe the colors are a little bit more muted, but like the, um, the colors in the actual art are brighter. And then you have the bright foil, which kind of, pops against a more muted um background color does that make sense i feel like i've noticed that and i can see like kind of how that works um since i i i did my like birthday spread with um gold hollow and lavender hollow which i was debating upon because the colors were kind of more muted but then with like the gold hollow it really brought everything to life so you know she knows what she's doing and i see that here so super super cute this is like a very hard month for me to pick my favorites because i really do like all of the kits like there's not a kit this month that i don't like and i think if i if i let's say i was subscribed to all of the mysteries i would have kept all of the kits this month and i would have known where to use them like i would have put this one somewhere in october as like an october mystery this one is already my lineup because it's i'm using it next week i definitely would have used this i don't know where i would have put it but i would have put it somewhere <sighs> But I maybe put it in September. I might have bumped a kit from September, honestly. I feel like my October lineup is looking a little full right now. But I might have bumped a kit from September or even like an August to September transition. You could even go, honestly, even into November, I would still use it. I know people want to go like Super Thanksgiving, but I would still use this in November. I don't, I think you could even use this. There's not a week this year where it's like a transition from Thanksgiving to Christmas, but you could definitely could do that. Or this could actually be kind of a fun Thanksgiving kit if you like don't do like a whole big family thing. It could be nice because you do get like the fall and like it is special. There's something very special about this kit. I don't know if it's like, it's not like reading very wintry to me. So I wouldn't go like into December really like all the way. But I feel like there's lots of places I could put this. I probably would have put this in September to be honest because I have a kit that I am looking to bump and I don't really have a reason to. And I really do need to use my old, old kit. So I definitely would have bumped this into there. And then this one, where would I put it? I don't know. It's such a good anytime kit. It might be something I would just keep on hand. Or honestly, I like to use kits like this. Like even if I'm not going on vacation. But something about like travel. Like if I have like a big milestone coming up or i try something new for the first time i like to use a travel kit because it kind of represents the same feeling like 
you're going to an uncharted place or maybe you're doing something that's uncharted to you. So this might be a kit I might use in January, maybe like the start of the new year, trying something out. Or like if I took on a different responsibility at work or something like that, I would use this kit here. So I feel like I have a place to put all of these kits and I like them all. So this is gonna be like a really hard month. I really don't know. I honestly don't know. what The kit that surprises me the most, honestly, is Glam Planner because I wasn't expecting to like it because I haven't really liked the past couple of months. But I think this is like the best Glam Planner kit of the year that's come out for me. Like I think this is stunning. Stunning. So cute. I'm tempted to pick it up. So that's like the most surprising. Well, but also Squirrel Prince Co. I wasn't expecting to like this. When I heard it was pop culture, I was like, mm, I don't really love the pop culture kids, but I really do like this. And I would have been like happily surprised if I had gotten it. So those are both surprising. I think I tend to like, generally tend to like the Tasha's kits, the Pink Diamond Planner Co. one. So I'm not as surprised, but I am also surprised that it's literally perfect for exactly what I'm doing. So I really need Tasha to make, <laughs> Tasha, please make me a falling in love, like fall kit. I, I guess it's like too late for fall. Maybe next year you can make me one. Um, Cause this is just perfect for exactly what I wanted. So I was surprised about that. So I really don't know. And it's just kind of unique and fun. And I was thinking it would be more fall like cause it's September, but this is cute and I like it. So I don't know, maybe Jen will have a more definitive answer for what kit she likes the best, but honestly, I love them all and they're all unique and different and can be used in different ways. And I just think that this is, this is exactly why I like to do these videos to like showcase the best of the best and like what's coming out from all the different shops and what makes each one unique. Like this is it. These are all beautiful kits. Yeah. So I would love to hear what you guys think down below. Do you have a favorite this month? Um, do you disagree with me? Do you really not like one of the kids? I'd love to know down below. Definitely go check out Jen's video. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful time when you're watching this. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, friends.